Yo, it is time, man. This is my official World Rolling Championship entry. Let's get into it. Yo, so uh, there it is, man. What do y'all think? It's my official entry into the world rolling competition, man. So uh, I know it's been long awaited, but here it is, the yacht. I've been putting up little uh, videos of my process, how I was rolling it, and kind of showing also how much it weighs officially. And I know I've been hyping it up like every single video. Uh, so hope you guys enjoy it, man. I hope you guys think it's as cool as I think it is. So yeah, man, I guess I'm just gonna kind of talk about it, kind of show you guys a little bit of a process of how it went down, what I did. This is uh, considered to be a hand-rolled uh, J, all right? Um, there are, you know, different ways you can roll, but uh, this one is, I'm actually gonna do two entries, all right? I'm doing a hand-rolled and then a mold, which we'll get into all that in, in a later video, all right? But uh, this is my rolled rolling competition entry number one, okay? Super excited about this one. So let's get right into it, man. So uh, you can see right there, uh, I'm gonna put up some videos on the side showing the kind of the process of how I, uh, you know, made this entire piece, you know what I'm saying? So this entire bottom piece, right? This was all one singular piece. I slashed it in half, okay? Initially, what I had done is actually slash it only about right here. And then I kind of left little layers on top and kind of, I was kind of trying to do it all in one piece, essentially, right? Um, didn't work out as I initially wanted it to. It just didn't look good. I couldn't get it to the way I wanted it to look. So I ended up making one, two, three, four, five different layers on top, okay? So these are all separate little layers that I, you know, rolled and then put together to make this one piece. And of course you got, you know, another one right there, these two little balls, three the, the little tiny ones holding it together. You know, um, got the little, uh, resting chairs, little cool. I got the pool down there that I cut out. You know what I'm saying? So uh, in total, I believe it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different pieces. Okay, so all in one, it is ten different little. Oh, I mean, including these little things, you can add a little what another eight. So eighteen, um, if you want to be that way. But ten main pieces. So as you can see there, I added the helipad, all right? So we can go ahead and probably roll ourselves up another helicopter. If you wanna go check out that video, I've already shown how to do that. But uh, we can go and maybe roll another one, put it on top, you never know. And if you couldn't already tell, there is a massive gaping hole there, all right? Don't get any, don't get any uh, ideas there. None other than a Bolshkis. Yes, sir. Yup, mm-hmm. You can go ahead and Take a little rip skis out of that if you please if you please so uh maybe i'll i'm gonna be pulling up to an event um pretty soon actually in a couple days and i'm actually gonna be trying it out for the first time i'm pretty confident okay i've actually kind of tested it a little bit but not fully full throttle all right but yes it should hit it should it does hit all right it, it, it hits well but um Super excited to officially try it at that sesh. So hopefully I'll be recording it. Video coming very soon. But yeah, so then now moving on to the back, you got the little cutout of the pool. So it has like a little bit of a 3D effect, you know what I'm saying? And then you got the little four little lounge pads. Uh, not lounge pad, what do you call them? Uh, what are those things called? The pool side chairs. There, pool side chairs. Um, got them kind of a blue and gray kind of going area. Got the little dock area on the bottom. You kind of put where like the, where you like the, the jet skis and kind of come in and out or whatever. I was thinking about putting uh, the name Cushmallows on there, but I hate doing letters. That's like my, my worst enemy is doing cutting out letters. And I already had hard enough time doing the H and it's just a couple little lines. <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, so as you can see, here is the initial paper. Right, so if I go like that, you almost couldn't even tell what it is. I po I, I did a, I did a lot of little sneak peeks on my Instagram, just doing stuff like this. A lot of people were thinking it was a spaceship. Now I know some of y'all might be thinking, why didn't I like videotape the entire process of me actually rolling this one? 
um, really simply just because I wanted to really focus on the detail and really trying to come up with something crazy. Um, I think now that I'm thinking about it, I definitely could have just recorded it, you know? But uh, I mean, I did the little recordings, like the videos I put, right? That's mainly just with my phone. But I'm talking about like for the actual YouTube channel, um, I didn't do, you know, like my traditional showing every single thing that I do, uh, simply because it, it, it's hard, it, it is hard. Um, rolling in general is hard, right? But trying to record yourself doing it while making it actually watchable is very difficult because you, you know, it, it's there's sometimes you want to get angles and I'm covering the angles I'm doing stuff like that it's very difficult all right and I really just wanted to focus and just put my all into this role um I'm pretty happy with it man I'm pretty happy with it I wanted to go for functionality as well you know what I'm saying because it's definitely definitely gonna rip all right I have no questions about that no worries because there's some roles which is actually another one that i'm working on which is actually a mold all right this is going to be a mold man but this one's hand rolled all right i did no molds with this one even these columns right here were separate rolls squished them down cut out the shape did all that stuff you already know how it goes around here man i don't use molds typically but for the next one um i really wanted to try this out i really want to get a lot of the detail a lot of everything so that one's actually gonna be a mold I'll be showing you the process of that one very soon because I've never actually done like a mold or I've done little molds where you can you know, mold a pencil and kind of do everything together. But if you want to call it a mold, whatever. Um, but I'm actually going to be molding uh, a toy. All right. My, one of my son's toys. So let's see how it goes. I'm going to be pretty fun. But uh, yeah, man. So for this one, that is why I did not uh, show you guys, you know, step by step uh, the process exactly the way I usually do with most of my videos. But um yeah, man either way i'm super excited with how it came out it kind of looks a little bit like a like a toy from far away you know what i'm saying um so it feels good it feels solid and uh i think I, I made it quality i made it as well as i possibly could you know what i'm saying but uh super excited to try it out officially at the i'm not gonna say the event i'm going to but i am going to a stoner event all right and uh we'll be showcasing this one all right and the other role which i'll be posting on the tubes very very soon uh make sure you guys follow my instagram though make sure you follow my instagram because that's where you're going to be seeing all the exclusive stuff that i can't be posting on youtube uh because i don't want to get you know youtube on my butt but uh yeah man so that's why i'm kind of keeping it as family friendly as i possibly can on here if you want to see more you got to go to my instagram and hopefully when i start streaming on twitch we can start putting these into really really start putting these into action know what i'm saying so uh yeah, another huge, huge, huge shout out. I'm gonna put, you know, somewhere around here. Huge shout out to Horn Creek Hemp. They're the ones who helped me supply the material that is needed for this entire roll. Um, they definitely helped out big, 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 because I it's so hard to find the, the money, really, the, the resources to, to get all the material I need to make something crazy like this. And they definitely hooked it up. So I'm not gonna be putting any, like, Stuff in the description. I don't want to get age restricted banned or anything like that. But make sure you go check them out on Instagram, Horn Creek Hemp. Huge shout out to them. Love y'all guys. But yeah, man, super super excited uh, about this entry. I think you know from the entries that uh, have been entered so far as of this recording, I'll be showing you guys as of right now the entries that have been entered so far. I think it has a pretty good chance of placing top three if you know. Any other crazy i'm sure a lot crazier ones are waiting to be posted but um you know i think this one's gonna give a run for the money and then of course i got another roll on the way but uh this one i was a little bit more specifically excited for because i've always wanted to do a yacht and well actually i have before i'll probably pop it up a little picture of the first yacht that i ever did it was like this big <laughs> compared to this monster like i said i think it's 123 grams so freaking beast but yeah man super excited uh so hope you Hope you guys, you know, like it as well. I think it's sick. Can't wait to put it into action. And uh, so, yeah, man, got a bunch of crazy uh, videos to come out very, very soon. Hopefully showcasing this one again in the future. A lot of the times I like, you know, use them. I'm gonna say use them very soon, like right after rolling, you know, cause they're meant to be used, right? I mean. A lot of times I think people kind of just want to have them sit on their, their desk somewhere, you know what I'm saying? Kind of just like, I could, I mean, it looks like a toy, you know what I'm saying? It looks like a, like a sculpture. Well, it is a sculpture, but you know, like a, something you could put like a, on your desk, an office desk thing. But, uh, 
I think I'm definitely gonna have this one do that for a while because I usually just kind of go straight into uh, using them and then that's it, you know, they're gone. Or sometimes when I just don't want to actually use it, I just take the material out and I use it with something else. But uh, this one's definitely gonna stay with me for a little while. Super excited about this one. Took me a while. Hope you guys liked it, man. I really, really hope you guys liked it as much as I do. I know I kind of hyped it up a lot, so I hope you guys are very excited. Um, but yeah, man, another roll coming very, very soon. So it's gonna be the first of two entries, all right? So super excited. Can't wait to show you the next one. And then I'm gonna be going to that event very soon and I'll be showing you guys. But yeah, man, super, super excited uh, about this entry. I think, you know, from the entries that uh, have been entered so far as of this recording, I'll be showing you guys as of right now, the entries that have been entered so far. I think it has a pretty good chance of placing top three. If, you know, any other crazy, I'm sure a lot crazier ones are waiting to be posted. But, um, you know, I think this one's going to give a run for the money. And then, of course, I got another roll on the way. But uh, this one I was a little bit more specifically excited for because I've always wanted to do a yacht. And, well, actually, I have before. I'll probably pop it up, a little picture of the first yacht that I ever did. It was, like, this big <laughs> compared to this monster. Like I said, I think it's 123 grams. So, freaking beast. But, yeah, man, super excited. Uh, so hope, you, hope you guys, you know, like it as well. I think it's sick. Can't wait to put it into action. And uh, so yeah, man, got a bunch of crazy uh, videos to come out very, very soon. Hopefully showcasing this one again in the future. A lot of the times I like, you know, use them. I'm gonna say use them very soon, like right after rolling, you know, cause they're meant to be used, right? I mean, a lot of times I think people kind of just wanna have them sit on their, their desk somewhere, you know what I'm saying? Kind of just like, I could, I mean, it looks like a toy, you know what I'm saying? It looks like a, like a sculpture. Well, it is a sculpture, but you know, like a, something you can put like a, on your desk, an office desk thing. But, uh, I think I'm definitely going to have this one do that for a while because I usually just kind of go straight into, uh, using them and then that's it, you know, they're gone. Or sometimes when I just don't want to actually use it, I just take the material out and I use it with something else. But, uh, this one's definitely going to stay with me for a little while. Super excited about this one. Took me a while. Hope you guys liked it, man. I really, really hope you guys liked it as much as I do. I know I kind of hyped it up a lot, so I hope you guys are very excited. Um, but yeah, man, another roll coming very, very soon. So it's gonna be the first of two entries, all right? So super excited. Can't wait to show you the next one. And then I'm gonna be going to that event very soon, and I'll be showing you guys how it goes over there. Super excited, man. Thank you all so much for supporting. Like, subscribe, do all that good stuff, man. Thank you all so much. Many more videos to come. Deuces.